Okay, so now we're gonna learn how to combine different types of charts in one single view. And here we're gonna mix the bars with the lines. There are different methods on how to do that, depending on the use case. The first one is using the average line. So first, let's go and build a standard bar line over the time. So in order to do that, let's get the order dates to the columns and as well the sales to the rows. And then let's switch the years to a continuous month. So let's change the format. And now instead of having the line, we're going to go and switch it to bar charts. So let's go to the marks and switch it to bars. Great. So with that, we have got our bar chart. The second step is to add a line. This line is going to be the average line. In order to do that in Tableau, it's very simple. Let's go to the analytics. And here we have the option of average line. Let's go and drop it to our view. So it's going to be for the whole table. And that's it. As you can see, it's very easy. With that, we got a nice average line combined with the bar charts. All right, moving on to the next method, we're going to go and combine the bars and lines using the dual axis. And here we're going to go and compare two different measures. So this time as a change, we're going to go and compare the number of orders together with the number of customers. So now let's go and get the order date in order to see the changes over time. And then the next thing we're going to go and get the order, the count of the orders to the rows. And now let's go and change the format of the order date to months and then change as well the chart to bars. So with that we got our first chart, the bar chart. Let's go and get our second measure and we're going to have it as a lines. In order to do that, let's go the count of the customers, put it near the rows. So with that we split it our view to two charts. Let's go and change the second one to lines. So we're going to go to the marks, switch to this page and then now instead of having bars we're going to switch it to line so now we have our two charts the bar chart and the line chart and as usual we want to go and merge them together in one single view so in order to do that we're going to use the dual axis let's go to the customers right click on it and then choose dual axis so with that as you can see we have a bar chart together with a line chart and of course here with the dual axis we can go to the right side and synchronize those two axes but for now it makes no sense and of course now we can add more custom Optimizations. For example, for the line, we can do the markers. So let's go to the colors over here and let's just add the markers to it. So that's it. Now we can go and start comparing the number of orders together with the number of customers in one single view using two different chart types. 